Gemini, welcome to your reading and this is your July the 5th and July the 6th of 2020. This is for Gemini Ascendant, Moon rising and Venus placement on their chart. Jupiter may also resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. So cross watchers, if I describe someone here and you know that it is not you, then it is not you. Okay, just because you are connecting with Gemini, you're going to assume that whom I'm describing here is you. Please don't. This is not a personal reading. For those of you who's new to the channel, uh, welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein you can ask me a question, interactive of course. Um, you have to click the notification um, bar or bell rather <clears throat> so that you'll be notified at every time. I'll go live. So, Gemini, <clears throat> if you will join the live streaming, um, I would suggest that you bring patience, of course. I am not answering questions in order. I have two hands shuffling the cards. I have no other hands to browse. So whatever question pops in the prompter, that's the question that I will answer, okay? Gemini, if you didn't catch me on the live stream, there's still ways for you to ask question, okay? Not on the comment section. I am not answering questions in the comment section. I am answering questions on the live or you have to fill up a form. It's in the description box. Click that link. You will be routed to my page. Tap in your question and click submit. Okay. Follow the instruction. If you also want to know your lucky number and lucky color, follow me on Instagram. There's a link in the description box. So Gemini, if you resonate with the reading, congratulations. If you do not resonate with the reading, come back to the reading after a week or two. Time is fluid. If you resonate with some bits and pieces, still congratulations for I am doing a collective reading. So Gemini, this is your reading. Let's start. Your overall energy, round and round. It feels like you are in this situation wherein things are going round and round. It things are, it feels like you are doing something, but Z result is still the same so you're kind of stuck into something because you're probably blinded by your overflowing love with a person you need to be enlightened as the hangman here you might be connecting with a scorpio or has a scorpio placement on their chart or you have a scorpio placement on your chart you're stressed right now because things are not coming to flourishing. I can see here that you want to give your, let's say, this person is probably giving you less of what you deserve, right? If I will use a corporate term, you are overworked, but less on, uh, but you're underpaid. But what you want is a equal give and take right in this connection that's why you're stressed this person is a little sneaky um why because you are placed in a competition the competition is here just so you know as you can see um this is another scorpio card a strong depiction that you have a scorpio placement or they have a scorpio placement on their chart as i can see here what you want is a communication okay what you want is the honest truth but you felt like the connection is dying right um there's no hope you're trying to let's say you're trying to make a move but you're stressed because any type of move it falls on the same you know place in the same ground um something here will change though there will be some communication this movement will i mean the connection will move 
you're gonna achieve your happiness mm, okay now here's the thing what I want to know is why you are stressed about you are stressed because what you want is the abundance um, ten of ten of coins there you go as you can see there is really a competition as I am seeing here probably you don't know okay? now you know that's why no matter what your no matter what is your um, move no matter what is your idea it's not coming to flourishion because the other person is busy with someone else this person is a little sneaky and yes three of cups what you want is celebration but this person is probably you know um, having party with another person this person left you in the cold or will leave you in the cold goes to you um, that's what I am saying this person might be a little sneaky just because of the other person goes to you um, left you in the cold blocked you let's check this competition okay as of the moment the person is happy with the person see you are in a competition they are happy here someone's also your person they also like your person so I kind of see here that there is already going on something between them and that's why you are stressed and I think that this person is doing this for like every time so this person walked upon you five of pentacles right so let's see here the king of wands king of wands is here let's see everything will come to everything will go to a calmer water why prince of pentacles this person will actually stop the connection with this person and will apologize to you that's what i am seeing that's why there will be some movement so upon from this separation i can feel that this person will have something that will find out that you are their wish fulfillment i think they are being seduced here that's what i am feeling princess of pentacles your person will have the enlightenment here that's for sure and your person will come back to you with apology there you go that's what I am seeing here Gemini Gemini 300 likes for this video and your next reading will be a full reading if you are already in this situation and you want to know what are the um, next move or what's the red flags there's a link in the description box you can um, ask for a personal reading if you're okay with this reading and let's say you just have a follow-up question there's a link in the description box click that link you will be routed to my page type in your question click submit so thank you so much for watching love and light to you namaste see you in the next reading goodbye